It is a beautiful day to build some cabinets, which is exactly what we're going to be learning about today. I am here at Imperial Custom Cabinets in Lemon Grove here with Art, who owns this wonderful shop. Art, why don't you tell us a bit about Imperial Custom Cabinets? Well, Imperial Custom Cabinets has been here since 1971. We're a family-owned and operated business, and uh, we're your custom cabinet shop here in San Diego County. Um, we pride ourselves in using uh, top quality materials, hardware, and state-of-the-art equipment to build your custom cabinets. And speaking of those, that's exactly what we're going to take a look at right here with these two um, cabinet boxes that you brought out for us. Tell us about the difference that makes Imperial Custom Cabinets great. Well, when you're looking at our cabinet versus the box store cabinet, uh, the front view it, it all looks to be normal. It looks to be nice, sure, but uh, drawers. yeah, you have to take a little closer look. And when you do that, you see that that uh, that they've used half-inch material for the box uh, versus our three-quarter-inch thick material. What happens is uh, on on the half-inch boxes, they just don't last as long. It's it's uh, they move around a little bit. Your doors are going to come out of adjustment. Your drawers are going to come out of adjustment. They're not going to slide as well. But when you've got a three-quarter inch box, it, it all holds together. It's glued and screwed with a mortise and tenon construction. It's going to be substantial, and your doors and drawers are going to be adjusted a lot longer. So I want to stop you right there, real quick. You said mortise and tenon joints. What? Why don't you tell us about what that means? So our cabinets are constructed with a mortise and tenon construction, and and so what that means um, is is a, a a type of joint that we use to build our cabinets. Um, we have a screen, a computer screen that sends uh, computer code to our CNC machine, and that's where all of our precision cuts are made for the CNC, uh, which make the mortise and tenon. And so now our mortise and tenon cabinets go together like a puzzle, and okay. we glue and screw, creating this substantial box. So that's here, this little tick. Yes, that's what you're seeing right there. That's the top of the tenon. And that keeps it real secure. Absolutely. Excellent. So back to the differences between you and the big box. We've covered now how size in this case really just does matter and the thicker construction box is going to last you longer. It's going to be sturdier. Right. What right. else is the difference between your constructions? You know, we talk about hardware. Uh, we use Bloom hardware. It's it's the state of the art hardware. Um, so, so we can come and take a look at the front and, and uh, see how the drawer slide over here it's, it's full extension. It does slide out. It's a little bit rougher uh, in the slides, and, and you've got to keep pushing to, to shut it and even snapping it in. Oh. Where, whereas our drawer, it's got full extension as well. It rolls a lot smoother, and, and you get it to about three quarters, and it's going to pull, the, pull it in the rest of the way. Soft close is what it's called, and, and uh, it's in all of our drawers, all of our doors. No matter how angry your teenagers are, they eh. just can't slam these on top. Not these drawers. They won't be slamming these. What else sets your drawers apart? Okay, so if we look at our drawer boxes here, you can see the difference in, in the, uh, they're both dovetail. This is a dovetail box. These are unfinished on the ends, which is going to allow for swelling. And, and you can see the joint is not quite as nice as what we've got over here. These are finished joints. So that protects the wood when protects you finish the, all four sides. Protects the wood. It's not going to swell and contract. And, and it's just a much tighter joint. It's going to last longer. So there are clearly numerous construction differences between going custom and going with something prefab, but what is the homeowner going to see on their side of this whole process? Well, when we come out to your house and, and we measure your walls, we're going to design our cabinets to fit in your location. So every inch of space is going to be utilized. We're not going to have to use uh, large fillers or, or things like that to be able to make up the inches. We're just going to make this cabinet an inch and a half longer if that's what we have to do. So this is the perfect way to really maximize whatever space you have allotted for where your cabinets are going to be or where your kitchen is going to be if you have an open floor plan. It's really a way to take advantage of all the space you have available. Absolutely. There's going to be no wasted space in our kitchens. And now what are homeowners going to see as far as drawings? Do they get a rendering? Are they going to see exactly what it's going to look like before it comes home with them? Absolutely. It's an interactive approach. So, so uh, we're there to help them design their dream kitchen. And, and we provide renderings, uh, shop drawings, elevations, floor plans, so that they can take a look at it and make any changes that they desire. We'll redo them and we'll get them signed off before we build. And not only kitchens, bathrooms and hallways, anywhere that you need cabinets. If you are in need of a space restructure or you're not getting the most out of your space, call Imperial Custom Cabinets today. You can come out to the showroom and take a look at some samples or they'll come to your home and take some measurements. Give them a call today at 619-786-6115. Back to you guys in the studio.